Hey guys, today's video is sponsored by Rei Boot. With one click, Rei Boot can help you enter or exit recovery mode absolutely free. You can also repair over 150 iOS, iPadOS, and tvOS system problems like stuck on an Apple logo, a constant boot loop, recovery mode, and so much more. It works on the latest versions of iOS, including iOS 14 and iOS 15 betas. So if you're encountering any issues with any of your Apple devices, I would highly appreciate it if you check out Rei Boot. Links, of course, will be in the description down below. Hey guys, I know myself here. Welcome back to the channel. And Apple has yet to deliver live weather for the lock screen of iPhone. But in this video, I came across a really unique feature that would allow you to have the next best thing in my opinion, which is live weather notifications on the lock screen of your iPhone. Now with the new updates to the weather app, I think Apple had a really missed opportunity to add these really cool animations and features to the lock screen of iPhone. But as I mentioned, we're gonna take a look at one of the best features for the weather app in iOS 15 that allows you to have those live weather notifications. This is gonna be very useful before you leave your home. If this notification is on your lock screen, you can see what the weather's gonna be like when you head out. And that way you can be prepared. Same thing for work and things like that. So let's just dive right in to this one. And this is what the live weather notifications look like in iOS 15 right there. Right before heavy rain started, I received this notification. And I thought this would be a handy feature to share with you guys on a standalone video. So let's head on over to settings here. And let me show you how to enable this because it isn't enabled by default. You want to head on over to notifications on your iPhone. And then you want to find the weather extension here for the notifications. So let's go ahead and find the weather extension. And once you find it, you want to tap into the weather extension here. And then you want to go into show preview. You want to tag that and you want to go ahead and select always so that always when the notification comes in whether you unlock your iPhone or not the weather notification is visible then you want to head on over to weather notification settings and this will bring you to the actual weather application now here you want to make sure that my location is enabled and make sure that you go ahead and turn on the weather for places that you normally visit and that way you constantly have the live weather for those places. Now mine's already preset here. There it is, my live weather location right there. You can see here all these really cool animations when it's sunny out, when it's cloudy out. I think Apple had such a missed opportunity to add these animations to the lock screen, but with live weather notifications, I think users might be able to at least get some type of weather on the lock screen to give you an indication of what the weather is like. And that is how easy it is to enable live weather notifications in iOS 15. Let me know what you think about this one. Would you prefer live weather notifications as shown here, or would you prefer the live weather animations directly on the lock screen of your iPhone, sort of like this, but on the lock screen? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.